Time now for a driving Mr. Blue. Yep, that's Blue. Out driving around. Stop by here. We're out on the MSU campus, Michigan State University. Stop by in front of the north side of Spartan Stadium. It's the site of the spring game this coming Saturday. Michigan State's going to welcome 6,000 fans um, via some type of an app. I guess you have to uh, work to, to get uh, access, uh, donors first and uh, regular fans later. It's just good to get people in here. God, it's been a long time since that many fans at a college football game here in East Lansing or in Ann Arbor, for that matter. Did not have a spring game in Ann Arbor last week um a practice it was last week or the week before i can't remember um media was not allowed uh it was not good um uh, you know that they can't access it it was there's a, a huge void here i hope the fall that changes um it's going to be interesting to see how this plays out between now and, and and labor day weekend michigan state i think with mel tucker i think they i think they've got the right coach um it's going to be interesting to see how they navigate 2021 and make improvements. They need better players. Uh, Michigan needs better players. They haven't won a Big Ten title since 2004. And, you know, when you get a number 10, another 11 recruiting class, and you can't really even compete for a Big Ten title, and Ohio State keeps getting better and better players. Um, I saw a stat the other day in the last few years, Michigan's had 20 or 38 transfers from their program. Ohio State's had 11, so that's continuity for the Buckeye program. Lack of continuity for a Michigan football program. As far as Michigan State, I think there's a lot of hope. Uh, still a lot of, you know, questions. And if Mel Tucker's the right guy, I think again, I think he is. And we'll see how that plays out in 2021. Again, I hope your Monday is absolutely marvelous. And we'll talk to you tomorrow for another Tom State.